Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. What sort of creature is that crawling? Wait a minute. A dragon. And a creature. I don't know if I should take a chance to see if it's non-hostile. It certainly looks... Horrific. What? Poison. Hmm, a sand scorpion. seen anything so huh, hideous and they certainly have a wealth of canis root on them look at that that sun Now it's attacking. Ah. Well, Dragon Ren doesn't seem to work on it. This is Mintana. This is what Inquisitor Pepe warned me about. Hmm. It's quite agile, too. Mintana, that's the end for you. So it's not a dragon. What? Altano's remains? So this is where he ended up. Huh. A dragon soul stone. It is said that Yunal, the sorcerer at, at Mora, tricked the dragons into sealing their souls into stone statues. It grants a dragon soul. All right, I'll take that. Look, the Blade of Mercy. This is the blade that Altano was carrying. I think I've got elite armor summons Mintana a piece of ball summons vigilant Altano <laughs> I'm gonna take that I don't know if I will use it but that man I have just hate to say it disgusted me I wonder if I would need these remains for anything I don't think so all right, well, now I know what happened to Altano. What? That looks like Inquisitor Pepe. It is. It's Vala's Gate, Inquisitor. Thank you for killing the worm. Oh, no, it's no problem. I can finally enjoy my wash again. I'm sure. Tell me what you know about this area. 
This is the territory of Lord Varla. If we don't want to become food for his dogs, avoid the fortress to the east and go north. Varla. Anything I should know about him. He's a knight who made a name for himself with the cleansing of Malada. But his mind is twisted, broken. He's now hunting humans with his dogs. After he ended up here, he swore allegiance to Morlag Ball. Of course he did. He was allowed to keep his human form, and he even got his own territory. Be careful around him. I think it should be the other way around. He needs to be careful around me. So, how do I get into the Imperial City? The main gate is to the north, but it's been sealed since the invasion of the Army of Order. There is a way, though. To the northeast of the island, there is a large sewer leading to the prison tower in the city. You may want to try crawling through it. If you're lucky, it will lead you to the Imperial City. If you're lucky. Of course. And what's the Army of Order? An infinite army, led by Jigalog. It invaded a few decades ago, and began conquering the entire continent. Almost the entire empire was absorbed and destroyed by Jigalog. After the defeat in the Battle of Wei, only this island with the Imperial City remained. Countless souls have been sacrificed to maintain the barrier. But even the souls have limits. And more like Ball's power is declining. The barrier will not last much longer. Then, Grey March will overrun the Swaceland and crush us all. Hmm, you're certainly the bearer of good news. So the Battle of Wei, what happened there? Jigalag manifested there at the height of the battle. A brilliant silver cocoon appeared and evaporated everyone around it. Regardless whether they were a friend or a foe, its light was dazzling. It was so beautiful, as if we suddenly stepped into Ethereus. Even I shed tears at that sight. Anyway, most of our higher nobility perished in that light. Only incompetents like Vernakis and Nukuata remained. <sighs> All this reminds me of the last days of the Elysian Empire. There was no winner. Only ruins remained. Hmm. All right then. Thank you for the information. Is there any way through this gate? Aha. The Sticky Key. Wait, is this this person that I spoke with before? Not sure, Sir Junkin? And you also defeated the Worm. Oh, it is Seems you. I was mistaken about you. Yes, and we meet again, and what brings you here? When I saw you walking around, I wanted to travel again. It's better than staying in one place and waiting to rot there. I suppose you... speak the truth. Do you know anything about Varla? I heard rumors he's insane. A half-breed of a human and an elf. He hunted elves at first and then finally humans. He was neither one or the other because of his blood. That's why he went mad. It's a pity, really. Why couldn't he just be both? Alright, well, thank you for the information. Search the statue. Sir Gregory's note. Dear friends, how are you all doing? A fat lizard nearly ate me, but as you can see, I'm still going strong. I know we can't be together anymore as we used to be in the past, but I believe we should still help each other. That's why I decided to put letters in the statues of Debella and place them across this land. I hope my research will be of some help. To you all. That priest, Pepe, told me that there is a fountain garden of Debella somewhere in the Imperial City. I'm going to go look for it. How ironic that a work of art that was lost in Tamriel so long ago 
is still present here. As a seeker of beauty, I can't wait to see it. On the subject at hand, have you heard about the half-elf named Vala? He used to hunt men with his hounds, and I heard that the fortress east of here belongs to him. You should stay away from it, unless you have some pressing concerns there. Who'd want to be chased by vicious dogs after all? Blessings to you, all on your journey, and long live Dabella. Interesting, so everyone keeps warning me away from that area and the dogs. So of course, I'm going to have to go there. All right, Sir Junkin. There's just so much here to see. What's this? What are you? All right, it's not trying to harm me. All right, there's lots of markers on my map. So much to see and do. To think this is Cold Harbor, I would imagine that it would be a much darker place. Uh -oh. oh. more of those things. Alright, well it looks like this is the way we're going. What's it carrying? Scorpion Venom. I don't think this is any stronger than the... the normal Spider Venom. In Skyrim. Oh, there is certainly plenty here. should go. Oh, I see some dogs. Is this the the castle that I've been warned about? And the half elf? as frightful as I was thinking they'd be. Yes, I think this is the way they told me not to go, to the east. in the light. Elysian priest, or we will drag you to it. And who's this over here? Someone else. Now these people are suddenly hostile. Mm-hmm. Who's got the stronger swing? It certainly isn't you. Abandoned house. Iron war axe. What's this? Another dragon's soul stone. So, according to what I'm being told, I should now have two dragon souls. What's 
this? <laughs> A dead worshipper. If you can truly say that someone is dead here in Cold Harbor. Take on the name Laza and become an immortal hunter. Chase and stone and hunt down the souls of those burned by the stone. Crush the stone and bring peace to the captive souls in the old forest. Okay. Is this the same book? Yes. All right. I've seen so many of these what Khajiit heard. Is there truly a map that I can look at? Here we are. All right, let's go this area here where it says blood is thicker than water. I think it's back this way. Oh, and I, another... Debellin statue. Is there a note inside? There is. Dear friends, how is your journey going? You're not hurt, are you? The hounds chased me and I almost died a few times, but I'm fine now and uninjured. Look at the stone statue of a woman nearby. It's a statue of a healer named Mary, and next to her stands a statue of a wolf. It seems to be an offshoot of an old faith of Mara. According to the priest Pepe, there was a, pa a place southwest of the Imperial City where its followers used to live in hiding. They were quite a zealous lot, so be careful if you travel there. Blessings to you all on your journey. So... There's just warnings in just every direction. I wonder if Cold Harbor is such a place that can be cleared out of all evil. All right, Fort Welkin. Here we come. No need for any of you to get up. The cleansing flames of Stendar will put you in your place. Hmm, these robes aren't for taking. Outside. All right, I'm hearing heavy breathing. Let's see what this lever does. Hopefully, not kill me. All right. I want to try. 
try something else. These creatures are truly dead. Light should be their bane. Alright, I know someone's... Oh, here he is. Yes, just as I thought. Conjure Ancient Flame Lurker. Another dragon soul? Search Coffin. Alright. Elysian Knight Helmet. Okay, we'll take that. Have any bow? there's any getting in through there. Oh, you are definitely undead. Or dead, however you want to look at it. Hmm. That's the sad part about Cold Harbor. The inhabitants are unaccustomed to light. Can't you familiar? Oh, that's a nice twist that Magicka is restored. On the detachment of the sheath from the integument. Though all given concavities or sheaths within the integument of the Arabus are necessarily contained by the Arabus. Right-reaching dictates that a defined sheath. All right, well. Interesting. <laughs> I'm not telling the truth. Sounds like gibberish. <laughs> Read once. It. Now it's Laza and the White Owl. Laza met the White Owl on the Green Meadow. The Owl stared at Laza's weeping eyes and told him, A shepherd may become a wolf if he lays down his staff, and he may roam the forest and hunt down his prey. A wolf may become the wind if he abandons his fangs. And then there is no place out of reach for him. And so he may eventually reach those he lost, but the wind may not blow straight. If you become the wind of order, your fangs will grow back and you will be a wolf again. Stendhal's clean cleansing light is just too much for you to bear. Don't bother. 
don't bother. There. Alright, there was nothing there. Uh-oh. Now that startled me. And I don't think this is a dead person. Hmm, but the armor is not for the taking. Alright, let me just make sure I... that doesn't look good. Who are you? Oh. dead, though. And that blow was deadly. All right. Beggar Prince. So this is Belhaza. Dragon Rider Knight Armor. It's quite ornate. Look at the spear. Hmm, nothing left but a burning skeleton. There's something in there. I mean, there's just so many different ways to... to go. So this is some sort of an elevator. I can go up. What is that? I suppose I should just attack you. Your Belhaza. Who is the child of a Minotaur? Who's a half bull? Who told you such nonsense? Are you saying unless she opened her legs for a beast? What a vulgar image, don't be a moron. Calm down, please. Silence, Vala! I'm not Don't Vala. Don't let your success at Malata go to your head. You, an alien orphan raised to knighthood by none other than I, Balhaza. I want the heart of Cesar. Bring me the heart of Cesar. The heart of Cesar! I told you we needed to kill this abominable Oriel. Bring me the heart, quickly! Heart of Shazar, what? Shazar is the agent of the one true god. He's the leader of the weak, spreading the might of the true god to every corner of Mundus. Vala, did you forget? You should know this like a lullaby by now. Is your alien blood making you forget? Do you really believe what that bard said? Don't worry, you are a child of Shazar. This abominable Oriel has abandoned you, but I, Belhaza, will never forsake you. So please, come to your senses. Be that bald man you used to be and get back to cutting off alien heads. Hmm. Single god, what are you even talking about? Hungry. I am so hungry. Don't even think about it. Attack me, it'll be the last thing you do. Who's the child of a minotaur? Are you saying unless she opened her legs for a beast? What a vulgar image, don't be a moron. I'm wondering. 
What would happen if I destroy you? I'm sorry, but... something about this creature. Ashes of the ageless sod with strange eyes increases health by 10 points. Can I eat this? I'll take it. All right, well that was useful. Vala's Hall. Oh boy. And here are the dogs. Uh oh, the Eye of Maruk. I suppose I need to bring it out then. It's just reacting. Are we to speak first, or should I just come in here swinging? Miserable wretch. What are you doing in my fort? Hmm. I heard you were looking for the heart of Shazar. Did you find it? That heart is nothing but a stupid tale of an old man. I have no intention of looking for it. The mythic era ended long ago. Right, very well then, I'm just passing through. Then pass. I'm sure you wouldn't enjoy becoming food for my dogs. Really, it's that simple. And what if I destroy your dogs? What? There. Now what have you got to say? Miserable wretch. What are you doing in my fort? I think I'm gonna pray. That's what I'm doing. Cinder, grant me your favor. And your divinity. Miserable wretch. What are you doing in my fort? I want your head, and I think I'll take it. And coming here was your last stupid mistake. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> well, it was destined for me to destroy him. So, a parrying dagger. Enola's skull. I'm not sure who Enola even is. 
This is some armor. I'm going to have to offload this. Piece of ball, Vala the Man Hunter. Can summon him. Saint Dulce's Nail. One of the nails said to have claimed the life of Dulce and her unborn child grants one perk point. Thank you. And look at this. Vala's Chotel. Does 20 points of extra damage when the target is blocking. And a white wolf pelt. I don't know if these skulls are important. Alright, I'll take it. Ah. Oh. Apparently, it is important. Where am I? What is this? Who are these people? Taking Machmontane was good work. And now we are one step closer to Malada. It was an honor, your majesty. Don't be so formal, Vala. We may not be related by blood, but what? I still think of you as my son. Your bell You can ease up. What should we do with the survivor? Vala, I ordered all Iliad killed, no matter whether man, woman, or child. As a knight of the Empire, you must overcome your compassion. Why are you hesitating to kill one or two more of these filthy Iliad? Strike her down now. It will be done, your majesty. Yes, Vala. Oh, no. Kill the Iliad. The I only good Iliad is a dead one. Where is the... Kill the girl. What girl? Do it for your own sake. Oh, I wasn't supposed to kill the girl. Who was this? What is with Lord Belazar? There was no reason to take this city. And who are you? Good evening. Hmm? So, what do you need? So the Lycian priests look like regular people. I don't have a... What girl am I supposed to be killing? Kill this the one? girl. Enola, the, the skull. For your own sake. Kill the girl. Is she Do it. Is she dead? For your own sake. Not even sure what I did or, or why. Right, there's nothing up here. All right, I should not have killed the girl. It's time for me to move on, though.
ahead. Make your move. I feel like I'm missing so much. Hold on, let me just go over here. Like there's so much here to uncover. Is this? Never should have come here. Really? Oh. Ah! Is this the chef? Beneficial potions make you fifty percent stronger. That's quite uh Hat. And look at this bloody cleaver. Especially effective against human races. And I hate to ask what's even in here. His victims, I'm guessing. Served up people. Activate Abbot Stillorn's hide. Right, what was this? Search the burnt corpse. Right, nothing. Torture tools. Alright, I'm gonna leave those. The art of the aliens. Uh oh, there's someone up here. Wait. The onion head again. Hello? You're marked as an enemy for some reason. Right then, forgive me. Knight of Giuliano's armor. Amulet of Giuliano's. All right. I think I lost karma that time. Now I'm carrying so much. I need to put it away. I came prepared. Hmm, Borlaw's bow. Okay, cannot put that away. The blade of mercy. Would like to use this at some point, but we'll put it away for now. Vala's showtell. All right. There. That should lighten the load. Since I don't have a companion. And is there anyone in here?
<laughs> Dull embers. And a histus flask. Might make a nice gift. All right, let's also recharge the morning star of dawn. I hope I'm not going to run out of soul gems. That would be very unfortunate. It looks like I'm finished here. It's time to move on to the next section of Cold Harbor.